And now to one of the surprises of the young season, Ainer undefeated coming into tonight. They're 3-0 as they were hot taking on the Johnsonville Flashes. Here's freshman J.P. Moreno taking this one 47 yards to the house. All of a sudden, quick lead for Ainer. Next Blue Jacket possession, though. A little problem right here with the quarterback exchange punt or snap going over Hunter Lambert's head. Johnsonville would take advantage as they force, you know, bad field position right there. It's Bryson Allison taking it in to tie the game. Moving ahead to the second quarter now. Johnsonville moving the ball again. EJ Davis up and in. Given Johnsonville a lead, they would not give back. Next flashes possession. It's Davis again on the little end around right here. Left side taking it in for six. And Johnsonville dominates this one. They take it 57-13. Well, now it's time for a new segment of WNBF News Extra Point. Sounds of the sideline. We're taking inside the mind of one area coach. This week, Ainer head coach Jody Jenneret is mic'd up. Let's go. Come on. Let's go. Let's play. Buckle up, man. Buckle up. Get ready to go to work. Score on three. Score on three. One, two, three. Score! That's good. This is good. This is good. Run! Run! Hey, run the day ball, man! Run the ball! Keep stripping that ball out, D. Keep stripping that ball out. The player cut the... No, I don't believe that at all. I, I, I don't believe that at all. How we go three weeks don't get that call? We get it tonight. He don't know what he's doing. Just try to get inside of him, okay? Just try to wear your hips inside of him. Then he runs back. That's fine. That's fine. We, we got something for that, okay? We got something for that. Good tack. No! It's in his back! It's in the back! It's in the back! Hit him in the back! They all terrible. Hey, 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 hey! DQ! Every play! Every play! But that's all right. We'll get it figured out. Well, good to hear from Coach Jenneret, even though they fell on the